Shut up and sit down. Hey friends, we are back and I'm still Simon. I'm Ellie. And we are still Nerd Safari. And if you enjoy our videos, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and of course to hit the bell. That would be very kind of you indeed. And you know, there's been a lot of content that's come out since we last checked in with you. But one of the most popular trailers at the moment releases on my birthday, 19th of November. Which, man, it only feels like a minute ago that I did a birthday live stream, and that's almost a year. But this movie is called Dharmaka, and I'm really intrigued to see the, how this story is told. It's based on the story of a 2013 movie called The Terror Live, and the story is about a journalist who scores an exclusive interview with a terrorist who's blown up a bridge, and the journalist then starts to receive death threats. So that's, that's all I know about the premise, but it sounds like incredibly high stakes. So we're going to go ahead and check out the trailer for Dharmaka right now. If you want to see what we think about it, then stick around until the end. But for now, let's go. Let's go. Today is Sunday time. I am Arjun Pathak, only on Radio Bharuswat. Our name is Raghuveer Mata and we are going to kill the ceiling. Let's go. 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 Let's Oh, so it's not someone who blew up a bridge, it's someone who's literally <laughs> doing it right now, yeah. This is my exclusive. You just give me a prime time seat. You'll get a seat from your prime time. We don't do news reports. You'll just bring our ratings on the page. Hey, you guys, what are you doing? I'm Arjun Pathak, and you're watching Bharosa 24-7. Whatever I'll say, कुछ हम आपको दस मिनट देंगे मंत्री जी को बुलाने के लिए मंत्री जी यहाँ पे क्यों नहीं आ सकते हमें सिर्फ माफी तो मांगनी है जनता के सेवा के गॉड डैमेट मैं तुम्हें अभी भी बचा सकती हूँ अगर तुम वो बोलोगी जो कंपनी चाहती है अगर माफी नहीं मिली तो पूरा ब्रिज उड़ा दूँगा पाठक जी जी मैं उम्मीद करता हूँ Welcome to the show. Wow. Wow, so Dharmaka coming on November 19th, my birthday, telling the story of a journalist who essentially seems to become the one form of communication with a terrorist who is literally going to murder his girlfriend if he doesn't get an apology from the Prime Minister. Geez, talk about high stakes. Yeah. I mean, we've seen a lot of movies about terrorism from Indian cinema in the past, and understandably, you know, it's unfortunately, it's something that's present right now. I wish it wasn't. But we've never seen a story told in this way before. Kind what, of real time. Yeah, what did you think of the trailer? It looks incredibly compelling. Like, I want to watch the movie right now, which is exactly what you want from a trailer. Mm. And, like, it lays out a few key plot points, but it kind of, it doesn't, give anything away and like the stakes just seem really high through the entire trailer so you just don't know what's gonna happen like is his wife gonna be safe whose idea was the divorce like he seemed to be having second thoughts about it she didn't seem keen either so there's like that whole thing as well so it's not like a straightforward love story either so it's kind of it's, it's really interesting that it's got all those different elements but the stakes are so high yeah yeah exactly like right from the minute he gets that first call into his kind of amateur radio show 
probably not expecting that an actual terrorist act is going to be committed while he's just, you know, trying to entertain people. Then he gets this this job, which must feel like a great <laughs> privilege. And then all of a sudden, he's in this inc- impossible position to try to negotiate with not only terrorists, but also politicians. And I, I'm guessing the story is probably also going to tell the story of, you know, politicians making decisions which impact the lives of normal people and you know in ways that in this case look awful <laughs> but uh and also well. it feels like there's going to be elements of exploring like w- the role of journalism and the role of um news programs and kind of media companies because he's got the i'm guessing it's the producer of the show who is you know she's got a very hard line and she's got different priorities to meet for the kind of commercial side of the news and kind of how does that impact real people? Yeah. Yeah. And I think you don't often see movies that tell the story of journalism and like how uh, biased journalism can be that every network has an agenda and a line that they're supposed to stick to and you're not supposed to deviate from that line. And uh, yeah, I think this movie could be interesting for so many reasons. Well, hey, thank you to everyone who recommended that we check out Dharmaka. There's been a couple of like small promos and teasers out there for a while, but wow, this official trailer looks great. So, yeah, and it's on Netflix India, so hopefully the rest of the world's Netflix subscribers, including us, are going to get it soon, hopefully with subtitles. That would be very much appreciated. Well, hey, thanks for checking out our video as well, and we will be back as soon as we can, friends, on the next Dork Trailer Ambush. Peace out, nerds. Bye! Shut up and sit down.